Alrighty, Mr. 1104 Gatekeeper here. Alright, bud. Here's your uh, Texas Star 350. Ooh, let's see. Uh oh. I forgot to bring this over here with me. Dang it. Throwing stuff all over the place. Yeah, I get to bed, y'all. Gotta drive to Manchester in the morning. Good God, I only got about four hours sleep as it is. Alright, brother. This is what I just had to do, man. Your meter uh, wasn't working. Basically, a real good buddy of mine, Mr. 073. Since I'm uh, so backed up, he's helping me out with the with a couple of uh, repairs. To get help me get this load off of me so we can uh, move to the next level here. And uh, he actually uh, got this amp working for you, man. He done a great job, too. And uh, he just didn't have a meter uh, over there. I forgot to give him a meter. But uh, I just went ahead and put you a brand new meter in. This one was shot. And uh, yeah, it's holding there pretty good. I don't see no reason why we should have to glue it. But it's holding there pretty good. Okay. That's the new style meter. You're going to have a little bit of glue residue. All right, uh, I didn't have any special instructions to do a complete rebuild, like a new top and a new front. We got these buttons looking good right here for you, man. And uh, take this off real quick, man. Uh, Mr. 073 Breeze, man, he went through this thing, man, got this thing looking good for you, man. Cleaned the inside for you. And uh, I know you had to put a new uh, new cap right here on the top. This is a little new for me, y'all. I'm not used to doing videos for... Uh, somebody else's uh repair associated with me it's usually me uh doing one one i've done <laughs> but uh i can remember everything he's done man he uh he had the wrong cap right here on the output he went ahead and replaced that with the proper cap there and uh i believe also the key and it, it needed uh i believe two new components in the key in circuit there we won't get too deep because i do got to go man we're gonna give you a quick output test but uh, one other thing is you had a, a plug. We'll just leave it at that. You had a plug on here as well as the one pill. And um, the one pill, it almost actually, the, the modulator, that plug was actually uh, catching fire on Mr. 073 over there, man. And uh, so what he went ahead and did is just took the plugs off. Okay. He got you a brand new inline fuse right here man real good quality went ahead and put that in line for you man i hope that's gonna be fine for you man uh i mean those plugs i mean there's nothing wrong with using the plug that you were using but um but you know they they, they, they were they were having a little issues man with, with the one pill and uh, i think it was actually okay with this one but he just went ahead and did a power wire upgrade for you too as you can see Okay, went ahead and did a power wire upgrade, and we took the plug off this one right here, man. If that's what you like to use, that's cool, man. You can put them back on yourself. Uh, we just went ahead and took them off because uh, something had got crossed, man. That joker was smoking. <laughs> that could have been the problem with this. Uh, Mr. 073 said if he would, could use his his most educated guess, that's what happened with the, the modulator is uh, that plug had a wire cross or whatever. So, uh, so there you go, man. Let me pop the tin back on this thing to show you the output put real quick. I'm just going to use my bench radio right now. We're just going to go full power. We're going to leave the, uh, let, let you see, too, all the lights work, too, man. Okay, we got all the lights right there working. All righty. All right, man, we're just going to go full bore, let you see a quick output test, okay? We're on the 1,000 watt slug. Oh yeah, right, that's right there about about 60 bird or so. Oh yeah, input tune. You don't want slow? Oh yeah, looks great, man. All right, let's flip over to PEP. Here's your PEP. Oh yeah, looking good, man. Right there about 300 and, let's see, 350, now 380. Oh, yeah. Almost 400. 380, 390. 
And uh, that's just driving four watts of drive into this bad boy, man. You hit this thing with a hot radio, big brother, you're going to be smoking, man. All right, buddy, let's get that thing out of line. See if we can't make this into one video real quick. See how fast we can do this, man. I was going to do two videos, but I am under some uh, time constraints here. So I don't kill myself going to Manchester. I know last... Last year, man, it was, it was okay on the way up there. Loaded up with caffeine and all, but uh, on the way back, man, it was a struggle. But I ain't too worried about it. I got my buddy 409, Mr. Mud Duck, that old crazy cotton picker, man. He's going to be going with me, so I'll 